Well, grace and peace, spot family and friends. Praise the Lord. Good morning on this wonderful winning Wednesday. We thank God for you clicking on and joining us and partnering with us in prayer this morning because this is the day that the Lord has made. We shall rejoice and be glad in it. I thank God for our midweek morning prayer call as we always stop and pause right in the middle of the week because I believe that's when God shows up the best and shows up the most because he wants to show and prove that he is God and God all by himself. Himself. Why do I say that? Because God specializes in showing up in the middle of your storm, in the middle of your circumstance. And I believe by faith that God's about to turn it around for somebody. I don't know who needed that this morning. You might want to type that on your social media page, write that down, tap yourself on the chest. God's about to turn it around for me. He's about to turn it around. He's turning it around in the name of Jesus. So I want to take this opportunity to cover you as you and your family, as you prepare to start this day. Come on, let's pray. Father, we thank you for your goodness, your grace, and your mercy. God, we thank you that your mercies are new every morning and great is thy faithfulness, God. Before we lay any petition before you or ask anything of you, God, we want to say we're sorry. God, we're sorry for the things that we have said, the things that the places we may have went, and even some of the things we thought, God, you know the thoughts, you know the number of hairs is on our head, you know everything about us. So God, we pray right now that you will search our hearts and our minds. If there's anything unlike you in us, we ask that you will remove it right now in the name of Jesus. We don't want anything to hinder our praise, hinder our worship, or hinder our blessings that's coming today. So Father, we thank you that you are a forgiving Father. And Father, we confess our faults to you right now. And God, you said in your word, if we confess them, that you are faithful and just to forgive us and cleanse us of all unrighteousness. God, we thank you for a new start. We thank you, God, for a reset. And Father, we pray right now that you will order our steps as we go to and fro. Keep us from any hurt, harm, or danger, God. Allow your angels to be encamped around your people. Let no weapon formed against them prosper. And let every tongue that rises up against them be condemned in the name of Jesus. God, we thank you for your protection. We thank you, God, that you walk with us and you talk with us. And God, we thank you for being our provider. God, we thank you for supplying all of our needs according to your riches and glory in Jesus Christ. God, I pray that someone on this call lacks nothing in this season. Father, whatever they stand in need of, God, I pray that you will bless them right now in the name of Jesus. If it's an emotional blessing they stand in need of, God, give them the peace that surpasses all understanding. God, if it's a relational breakthrough they need, Father, I pray that you will mend hearts. God, that you will bring it together if it's in your will. Father, I thank you right now for your physical blessings. God, with your stripes, somebody is healed right now in the name of Jesus. We thank you. We declare, we declare it and decree it right now over their lives. God, we thank you that healing is their virtue. Father, we pray right now that you will just take us to new heights and new levels in you, God, from faith to faith and glory to glory. Bless us spiritually, God. Blow our minds, Father God, with the things that you want to do in us and through us, God. Use us any way you want to use us, God. We will be careful and give you all the praise, God, because we know that if it had not been for you, we wouldn't have anything that we have, God. So we thank you for the gifts that you have given us, God. We thank you for everything that you have given us. And God, we pray that we're good stewards over it, God. Thank you, Father God, for being a, a father that sits high and looks low, God. We thank you on this day for what you are about to do, God. We believe that you're about to turn it around in our situation, God. We believe that the worst is over and the best is yet to come. So God, we're not gonna wait till the battle is over. Over. But God, we're going to give you praise this morning. We're going to give you praise in advance right now. Father, we lift up right now Brother Dennis, God, who had surgery on last week. God, we pray for him and his fiance, Ru 
smooth roads, God. We thank you for them, God. And we pray healing is his virtue, God. Continue to be with him and walk with him. And God, we pray that you touch even our, our auntie, God. And you pr you touch uh, Sister Shirley Jones, God. We pray that you touch her in her body, God. We pray that you touch uh, Sister, Sister Perry, God. We thank you, God, that healing is her virtue, God. We thank you for each and every one who stands in the need of a touch from you on today. Do it in the name of Jesus and we'll be careful and mindful to give you all the praise and all the glory and all the honor. It is in Jesus' name that we do pray. Amen and amen. Well, listen, family, I pray blessings over your day. I pray you have an amazing, amazing day. And keep in mind that God is about to turn it around. He's about to turn around. Look, tonight, tonight, I want you to join us at 7 o'clock for a word during our midweek refill, y'all. We need to continue to get that refill. So join us. And remember, this is Family and Friends uh, Month. So please invite a family member, invite a friend, invite a coworker. Tell them to join us and meet us at the virtual spot. Look forward to seeing you. God bless you. God keep you. That is my prayer. Love you all.